attention. We got Linus or something else here, everybody. I didn't even, I didn't even think about this. Are What's you aware? Day? Are you aware that, that TLC is on Sunday? No. Well, you are now. All right. All right. We got uh, six matches announced: Drew McIntyre, AJ Styles in a TLC match for the championship. Fiend versus Randy Orton. No stipulation right now. We'll see if they add one. Nia Jax, Shayna Baszler versus Asuka and Lana. And they're doing Lana versus Asuka tonight. So my guess is that somehow this is going to lead to something involving a table. And they will announce that it is a tables match coming up at the pay-per-view for the titles. Which would mean that Lana can get her big victory. Put Nia through a table. They win the tag team titles and... For a couple of weeks, happy ending around Christmas time, they end up as the tag team champions. We've got Roman Reigns versus Kevin Owens in a TLC match for the title. Sasha Banks versus Carmella. Thank God that's still on after that SmackDown match. And the New Day will face the Hurt Business for the Raw tag team title. So that's your lineup there for TLC. And it's Sunday, everyone. It is this coming Sunday. So, be ready. Excited? You don't sound like it. I'm not. Hmm. Although, New Day and Hurt Business, I am looking forward to. I think I'm going to like that a lot. I, I figured that. Uh, Reigns and Owens, hard to believe that that's not going to be awesome. Uh, uh, Sasha and Carmella, the other women's tag match. You know, I guess somebody's going to be happy because Lana is going to get her. I would assume she goes through a table tonight and then gets her revenge and, and Nia can go through a table as, or I, I guess. Although with WWE's logic, Nia won't be the one to go through the table. Lana will put Shayna through a table, you know, or something like that. And Fiend Orton, no thanks. N not not into that one at all. And Drew and AJ, again, with who in who's involved, I can't believe it won't be good, but a lot of times with these shows we talk about left up to their own devices in the ring. The talent is fantastic. They do great work and it's the lead up and it's the finishes oftentimes to these matches and that can't be blamed on them. But with, with unfortunately the fiend being involved with, with Lana being out there with Nia being out there with Carmella, unfortunately lumped in with all of them being out there. Um, you know, I, I don't know if the quality is going to be as great, but hopefully the other matches take care of it. Bro, if they do that tables match at the pay-per-view and Lana wins by putting Shayna through a table, I'm not going to say I quit because I don't want to dare anybody. But mentally, I quit. I actually quit a while ago with this stupid booking, but... You know what? I How do you put a... You, she put her through a table, what, nine times? What was the you number that they came up with? Oh, I think they're up to 11. It's like nine or, or 11 times, and you're going to go and do a tables match in the pay-per-view and not have her put that... How? I'll tell you exactly how, because how many times have they done something on a pay-per-view or a, a special broadcast, and it led to something on Raw? So the heels narrowly escaping, which would be awful, <laughs> but or, or Shayna being put through the table by Asuka, so on Monday night, Lana could put uh Naya through a table. I mean, it's not out of the, the realm of possibility with some of the dumb stuff that they do. No, actually, I mean, w tonight, tonight, Lana should put Shayna through a table. They should do their match. Obviously, it's going to be some sort of schmoz. Asuka's going to run in. You have a big four-way battle, and it, it should actually... For once, it should be like an accident where they're fighting or whatever. Not, not necessarily even an accident, but in a brawl outside, something happens and maybe the heels are going to do something and Lana slips behind and boom, she puts Shayna through this table. Shayna's furious that she got embarrassed by Lana. They make the challenge for the tables match in the pay-per-view. And then, obviously, Lana's got to put... And listen, do, you, do I really want to see Lana's tag team champion? No, but you wrote this story. At least do it the right way. Lana puts Nia through the table. They win the tag team titles. They can lose them back on Raw in a couple of weeks. It doesn't matter. It's... I get so frustrated thinking about this because... It's so easy. You wrote a dumb story... It sucks, but you know what? There's a way to make it work in the end. Just do it. When's the last time you had Cheetos? Been a long and time. I don't mean picking them up off the floor and everything with the kids. I don't When's like the last Cheetos. Time you actually had Cheetos. I like barbecue Lay's potato chips. That's it. 
to or just plain. Pretend. All these have you got have you hot the ranch chance? Doritos and all this other garbage? It's terrible for you. Cool ranch Dorito. Have you ever gotten the uh, the uh, the potato? Have you? The, they're like potato chips, potato. But they're chicken breast. What? Yeah, a it's chicken like, breast it's potato some, chip? Some keto thing where it's like they actually have sliced chicken breast. Thin. Actually, no, but I'll tell you something, Mike. Because I'll say this. They're cut dang delicious. No, they no, 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 no. Bro, listen. What? I was at the store the other day. <laughs> tell me what tell me what's good and what's not. I am gonna tell you what's good and bad. Geek. I was at the store the other day and I just was walking through the store and all of a sudden I thought, what if they make keto pizza? So I went to the pizza aisle, and I'm looking around, and there's all of these, you know, it's like, oh, this one's made from, the, the crust is made from cauliflower, cauliflower all this yeah. other stuff. And then you look on the back, and it's like, the crust is made of cauliflower, it's still got like 5,000 carbs in it. Like, what's the point? Either eat the pizza or don't. So anyway, I finally find one that has like almost no carbs in it. I'm like, well, how do they make this thing? So what they do is the crust is made out of eggs and chicken. I was like, yeah. eggs and chicken? This sounds disgusting. But I got to try it. So I bring it home, and I bake it. And in fact, it was disgusting. <laughs> it's absolutely disgusting. It's like I took a chicken breast and put, like, marinara or whatever the red sauce is and then cheese and then some sausage or pepperoni on top. Who would eat that? So, no, the chicken pretending to be something else, that not work for me. Gross. Why wouldn't you just eat potato chips, Mike? You'd eat a piece of chicken shaped like a potato chip? Uh, like I said, I tried these things, and I can't remember the name of them, but they were actually very, very good. But then again, I would have never thought to look for a pizza and actually go and buy that like you did. So who's the sucker? Well, I was a sucker, but I thought I'd try. Let's see if Dagan's ever had anything like that. Dagan, you're on the air. What's going on? Slow news day here. Hey, guys. <laughs> well, shout out to the Twitch homies, first of all. Second of all, I, I got to go for the uh, pizza-flavored Pepperoni goldfish. That's the way to go. Pizza uh, flavored pepperoni goldfish? It's old school. I used they to just are do the pretzel. Absolutely delicious. Bro. You gotta go for the pretzel flavored ones, the pretzel flavored ones, the pepperoni flavored ones, or the just plain goldfish. Disgusting. That is my snack right there. Disgusting. Wait, 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 are you saying all goldfish are disgusting or just the pepperoni ones? They're all disgusting. What are, you, what are you doing? What, what are you doing? Eat some actual kids? fish. Go ahead, Dagan. You what's, don't actually what's going have on? any goldfish sitting there? The big old box? Come on, man. And then all of this chat can talk about is potato chips. It's a polarizing issue. And by the way, all of your answers are wrong if your answer is oh. not Utz, kettle chips, crab chip, and salt and vinegar. Gotta I'll grant you, chip, I'll grant you that vinegar. kettle chips are winners. Yeah. But I like plain kettle chips, and I like barbecue kettle chips. Because you're plain and boring, that's why. And all these you have ridiculous no spice in your life, sucker. random flavors. Salt and vinegar is fantastic, and if you were from this part of the country, you would know the power of Old Bay and know the power of crab seasoning. Crab chips are Bro, fantastic. I'm not from that part of the country, so why would I like what you like? I'm from the I don't, Pacific You don't Northwest. like anything. Obviously, you like plain-ass potato like chips. I like fish, so. beef. What a Real serial food. killer. You're a serial killer. Ribeyes. Plain That's a ass, horrible accusation. Plain ass potato chips. Who does that? Well, I mean, I do. And I like barbecue potato chips and mm -hmm. ribeyes and New York strip steaks and and chicken. Your heart's just going to be on me, too. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm close the toilet to like death Elvis right now. Trying to, trying to post all that out through your intestines. Look at you right there. Mm -hmm. You're telling Looking me good. I'm close to death? Looking How fantastic. dare you. All right. Anything else here, everybody? What do we have? I'll read one last one right here. Cauliflower pizza are for vegetarians or vegans. Dude, anybody can eat anything they want. Unless they're America. vegetarian or vegan, then you can't eat meat. But that's, well, that's not on me. Oh, well, yeah. That's a choice. All right, everybody. If you're a big fan of these video clips here on YouTube, you're missing out on full-length shows. Down there on the bottom right-hand side of the screen, click that Join button, and when you sign up, you'll have full access to all of the shows that we've got up on YouTube, over 300 at current count. Wrestling Observer Live, The Brian and Vinny Show, and Figure Four Daily with Filthy Tom Lawler and Lance Storm. Hit the Join button, sign up today. You can also click Subscribe, and you'll always be alerted as to when new shows and clips are available.